Hi there. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to use SendKeys in Selenium VB.NET. So this is google.com homepage and I'm going to use this text box. So how I'm going to use this text box in our test, basically I'm going to send some characters to this text box using send keys. You can send characters, you can specify some click, you can perform keyboard operation all with this send keys. So first thing, let's find out ID of this text box. Right click and inspect element. Select this text box. Check for the ID LST-IB. Once you do that, open your Selenium VP.NET console project. Now type in imports, then system.text, then imports, open QA dot selenium, and then imports open QA dot selenium dot chrome. Once you call for these two classes, you can also use imports openqa selenium dot support dot ui. Okay, now I'm going to create a driver as iWebDriver class. Okay, then driver equals to new Chrome driver so that it creates Chrome driver instance. Next driver dot navigate then go to url inside that point to http google.com now i'm going to create one more variable let's name it element as then call for iweb element now equals to driver dot find element inside that check for let's say i want to find element by id that we just checked the id is lst dash iv make sure it is in small and within the quote so lst dash iv and once you find that you will take some pause so type in system dot threading dot thread then sleep within that pass 5000 number for the amount of seconds this is milliseconds number then call for element dot send keys here we type in open qa dot selenium dot keys then dot and simply say it's let's say if you want to just pass on characters you will say selenium okay and if you want to let's say perform some key action then you type in open qa dot selenium dot keys dot enter so this will just enter and in such case you have to instead of using this id you can choose one of the buttons okay for example if i use btni and then choose enter then this button will be clicked i am feeling lucky so let's do that click on start button just in case if we fail to find that name or id then it will throw some errors on our command prompt so pay attention to that okay so let's take a look at both these at the same time and as you can see it failed to find that reference so let's break it out and check that this is not some id and its name okay so btni is name here so we are going to find that with our program and then perform that click click on start button so we'll start console then it will check for 
that ID and then it will perform the click. Okay, as you can see, it performs that click and takes you to Doodle's page. So it found that particular name of our button. Okay, now what if I want to send some search text? In that case, we will use our ID that we just checked. Then use lst-ib. And here I'm going to use our search term vb.net testing. Now, I'm going to click on a start button which will start console instance and then Chrome browser okay so this starts console and then browser takes you to google.com and then it will perform the search okay and here you see vb.net testing added within the text box okay so this is our short video on how to use send keys in selenium vb.net test project.